Murphy, I appreciate you being here today talking about constitutional rights and all, but in my hood, police don't care about nobody's right. They do whatever they want. Tell us more. The other day, I was leaving my building on my way to work. Uh-huh. Ahorita, yeah. En 30 minutos llego. A las 5 dentro, chequé el sketch. Sumo, ahí te caigo. No, no voy a llegar tarde. Voy, voy. OK, va. Where's the dope, man? Come on, give it up. I ain't got nothing. Let me see your pockets. Pull them out. Your ID? Got an ID here. Run that, please. Let me see your hat. I seen you coming out of there. Yeah, that's a known drug spot. It's my home. That's where I live at. You go to school? Or are you working? I work at a restaurant. That's where I'm going. He's clean. Get your stuff. Thank you for your cooperation. You stay out of trouble. This is not the first time. It probably ain't the last. That's how they do around here. I'm not surprised. In cities across the country, these stop and frisks are occurring at record rates, especially in low-income communities of color. They happen so frequently, they seem perfectly normal to you. Yeah, that's how they do. This might be common, but that doesn't make it right. In fact, it sounds like those cops searched you illegally. 